What's going on? Welcome again to another Teen Series Showcase. For today, I have the February BAM Gamer Box. Now, uh, franchises in this one were Pac-Man. Oh man, what else was in this one? Star Wars, Knights of the Old Republic, Uncharted, and Animal Crossing. Yeah, I got them all. Uh, Autograph-wise, what would I would like would be probably something from Uncharted would be kind of cool, Nolan North. Um, and uh, yeah, that'd be nice. Now, here's the thing, though. Unfortunately, this is the last BAM Gamer Box, unfortunately. Um, it's very sad I've been getting BAM Gamer Boxes. I got every single one last year. Uh, I've been getting them since the beginning when they did the first one with the uh, Lifeline Funko Pop that was signed. And it came with the uh, Resident Evil Stars badge. I think it was um, the Cloud from Final Fantasy VII pin and uh, something else. But I I've been getting this box for a while, so it's sad to see it go, but... Uh, BAM did announce saying that everything that would be from this box, as well as, um, they said Junior and Cartoon are gone too. Everything from all these boxes is going to be moving to the Geek Box, which I'll be switching to the Geek Box then. Um, which the next month Geek Box is stacked. Which actually, before we get into this, um, because next month they have the Mandalorian as well, but not quite Mando, but pretty damn close. Um... I was going to hold off and do a video for this, but I really didn't want to. I uh, decided to open it. So, uh, I <laughs> opened up the Zobie Signature Series for the month of, I think it would be technically the March one for them, uh, which was the Book of Boba Fett. Very exciting. And I got this. Kersantin Autograph. I believe it was Carrie Jones. Um, Kersantin was my favorite character in the Book of Boba Fett. Um, I... <laughs> At first, I just sat there, I'm like, oh, okay, man, do I want to wait until my band box comes in to open it, or do I want to just open it? And then the uh, impulse came through, and I'm like, I'm just going to open this and uh, see what I get. And I got Kersantin, and it's awesome. I love it. Um, yes, it's already in frame. It's technically already up on my wall somewhere, but I had to take it down just to show. All right. Now we're going to get into the gamer box here. So here we go with the final BAM gamer box. All right. So we're going to start off with the pin, per usual. Uh, I think they also did the uh, coins again, and if I'm guessing the coins, Pac-Man would make the most sense, but we'll see. All right, but here is the pin. One, two, ooh, pretty big pin. Three. Ooh, okay, it's uh, Celeste from Animal Crossing. That is a very cute pin. Um, Very neat. So that's the Animal Crossing item. I love Animal Crossing. I haven't played it in a long time, but like when um, it came out uh, just before COVID, that was a great time for it to come out because uh, <laughs> I stayed inside and just constantly played. Oh yeah, so next is a t-shirt. It's white. Not a huge fan of white, but let's see what we got. Okay, well, it's a nice shirt. We got uh, Snake from Metal Gear, Cloud. Crash Bandicoot, Mario, Link, Sonic. Uh, not sure about that one. Battletoads for sure. Can't remember that one. Kirby was yellow. And Donkey Kong with a Sega Genesis controller, SNES controller. Oh, there's BAM's logo right there. PlayStation controller. So that's kind of cool. Might be like a nice nighttime shirt for me because I don't like to wear white shirts usually. Um, they get stained too easily, especially owning a dog. But that's kind of a cool shirt. All right, moving on. What's next? We have oh, a little BAM sticker. It's for Valentine's Day. Oh, it's cute because he got the box of chocolates and a rose. Thank you. That was nice of you. All right, going further, there's another sticker. Oh, there's... oh it's the same sticker. <laughs> it's the same sticker. I just got two of them. So, yes, we got coins. These were cool. Um, I'm happy Bam did them uh, come the end of this, and I'm kind of hoping that, you know, since everything's mixing together, if they continue with these coins, that'd be cool. But uh, my guess was Pac-Man for the coins, which would leave Uncharted and Star Wars. But let's see. So we see... Oh, I'm right. It is Pac-Man. So there's Pac-Man. And it looks like I got four coins this time around. So next up we have the cherries, a strawberry, and lastly, uh, one of the ghosts. 
And then on the back, it just says no cash value. Bam. Kind of cool. I love these coins. They're neat. Because uh, it reminds me of when I used to go to uh, an arcade as a kid. Um, back where I used to live. So, very nice. Alright, so now we're down to the last two things. We're down to a art print and a autograph. Which both of them are going to be, uh, in my opinion, fantastic. Because we've got Star Wars. I believe it's nice to be a Republic. And... Um, Uncharted, so I'm just going to show you that BAM COA there. That's just for the art print. So it says, this fan art inspired art print from our fan art collection was created exclusively for a single run print for the BAM box. It has been hand signed by the artist who created it. It is guaranteed to be authentic. One, two, three. No. Okay. So first off, this is a fantastic Uncharted print. Uh, one, number eight out of a thousand. Uh, very, very nice. I do enjoy Uncharted, but that means that the autograph is from Star Wars. That's interesting. But there we go. Very, very cool art print from Uncharted. Okay, that's a little more surprising that there is a, uh, Star Wars autograph? So let's go ahead and see this. One, two, three. Okay, so Turian, it says on it. Okay, so I'm not 100% sure who that is, um, unless it's just one of the main guys. So, yep, okay, I figured. It was Johnny Nombo, uh, who more commonly known as one of the uh, Black Rangers from Power Rangers. He's also Ichigo Kurosaki from Bleach. I know that. Um, which makes sense because Bam did do, uh, an autograph of Ichigo for their box, so they doubled up on this one. So, Star Wars The Old Republic, Turian. Okay, so that's kind of what he looks like. A little anticlimactic, in my opinion, for the last gamer box, honestly. Um, but let me get out this. Alright, oh yeah, the other prints would have been better, honestly. But, here we are. I like that they changed the card back from what was last month where it was kind of just plain. It's still pretty plain, but you know. All right, so we got uh, an animal pin, Alley Cat Graphics Animal Crossing pin. So just some Animal Crossing pins. It doesn't say if these are exclusive or not. So let me look at the back of Celeste here to see if there's numbered. It's not numbered, so that must mean that the pin is just the common pin. Which makes sense because I don't remember the cat on here. I'll show you in a second. Um, but everyone wanted that cat in their game. So I'm assuming that's the uh, exclusive. Uh, the Pac-Man tokens, those were awesome. And last month, uh, the turtle tokens, one of them was a level up technically. And I ended up getting it. So that's really cool. Um, the t-shirt is by Andre Philippe from 90s Games. Uh, the art print by Ryan Van Dogen. Um, was one of two Uncharted prints. That I know is from the second game, and I'm pretty sure that's from the first game. And then the autograph, Johnny on Bosch, uh, Star Wars The Old Republic, Turian. I do not remember him as a character in the game. But, nonetheless, um, moving on. Here we go. Oh, and then we, of course, got stickers. Um, so... That would leave us with, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, and queen of six. So at number six, I'll just go and say stickers. Um, not that there's anything wrong with them. I do like stickers. I'll probably end up putting one of these somewhere. Um, at number five, I'm going to give it to the t-shirt, only because it is a white shirt. I am not huge on white shirts, so I'm not really sure what I'm going to end up doing with this, but I'll figure that out. Um... Four, number four, number four, number four. I am gonna give it to the pin. I like it. I'm keeping it, but just number four for me. Uh, number three, go ahead and give it to, and I'm gonna go crazy here. I'm gonna give it to the autograph, um, just because I'm not remembering this character from the Old Republic, um, so I'm probably gonna have to look it up and figure it out, but um, for now, it's number three for me is the autograph. At number two, going to go ahead and give it the Uncharted art print. This is fantastic. I'm 100% keeping this. Um, I just love it. 
And finally at number one, the Pac-Man coins. I love the coins. Um, can now put them with my other ones. So three bags of coins. I love it. And then of course the uh, bonus extra was uh, Chris Anton here. But that is it for this video, guys. And that's unfortunately it for Bam Gamer. Um, yeah, Bam Gamer was fun. I I loved every second of it when I got them. Um, I wish I could keep going with gamer boxes, but the uh, geek will be have to bleh, geek will have to be where I'm at for that. Um, so be on the lookout for those videos coming up. Horror I'm still getting every so often, so I haven't quit on that. And Zobi I do get every so often. Same with OC Celebrity Marketing. I still will get those things, just um, not as often. Um, but I did go ahead and get the BAM Plus box for Extinct, and I did get the bigger box, so be on the lookout for that video when it does come out. Um, by the time this video gets posted, uh, this will probably be my fourth video since coming back. So, um, again, I'm not doing the 250 subscriber giveaway right now. Maybe when I get closer, we'll see. Um, but be on the lookout for that. Guys, if you enjoy this video, please, please, please hit the like button. Make sure to comment on the video. It has help as well. Share the video. Definitely will help us get to 250 subscribers if you want to do that contest. Um, check out the links below for various links such as the Bambox, Zobi, OC, all the ones I mentioned, as well as the T-Series Showcase eBay page. Uh, unfortunately, T-Series Collectibles is no more, so everything I did have on there is now on T-Series uh, Showcase. So many things at once. But yeah, so be on the lookout for that uh, down in the comments if you would like to purchase anything that I have for sale. Um, it might even be as far as this autograph might be up there. I haven't decided yet. Um, but yeah, so that is it for this, guys. Uh, Bam Gamer has been great. I loved it. I uh, can't wait to see what Geek brings. But in the meantime, that is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.